Does the Sunrider soft top for the Jeep Gladiator leak? Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. That's right, I'm gonna test it today. I am so excited because you see, it's raining outside. Now normally people don't get excited about rain, but when you're a YouTuber and you've got a new soft top, new I say a couple of months, on the Jeep back here, you wanna get it out and test it and see if it rains, but it never rains here. Today it's raining, so we're gonna go out we're gonna take a drive and I'm gonna see if this soft top that I put on the Gladiator right here, you can see it's the best top soft top, if it actually is watertight. Let's go. Cold start. Okay, here we go. We gotta get out in the rain before it stops. You know, it rains so infrequently here. Oh, and you'll get to hear what it actually sounds like. Let me turn the air conditioning off what it actually sounds like on the top. So let's, uh, let's get back out of here. Take a ride because this is the first time and you guys are coming with me. It's the first time that I've had the Jeep out in the rain with my new soft top. So here we go. We might have to kind of chase the rain a little bit. I, I don't know, I'm not sure. But uh, we're going to see. This is exciting for me. I've been waiting. The only time it rains, I shouldn't say it never rains here. It rains, but it usually is at like 3 o'clock in the morning, and it's uh, some sort of a massive thunderstorm. You know, severe thunderstorm warnings. Had a couple of tornado watches. Even had a couple of tornado warnings. I don't even know how to turn on the windshield wipers. Jeez. All right, let's... Uh, Let's get out on the road here and uh, and see. I can hear it. Can you hear the rain? It's not a driving rain, but it's rain. Okay, here we go. We're gonna we're starting out in uh, like a lower speed limit area, right? I mean, like 25, 30, 40, whatever. And then we're gonna get on. We're gonna take a trip down a higher speed road. I gotta figure out how to turn on the windshield wipe. Ah. You twist the thing, you don't pull it up or down. I know a lot of you out there are saying, geez, it doesn't even know how to turn on the windshield wipers. Well, that's what happens when you live in an area that never gets any rain. So, here we go. Let's get out on a higher speed road and it's starting to lighten up already. I'm gonna drive, hopefully into the rain. I think I can, yeah, I can still get into the rain, I think. I don't know what happened to my lights. My lights should be on, but I have no screen. Where's my screen? Ah, there we go. Ah, isn't that interesting? It's just, <laughs> this is the first time that I've had the headlights on. Um, it's actually the first time I've had the headlights on driving, other than the, uh, oh, what, the daytime running light things or whatever. So, all kinds of new experiences for me here today. Uh, again, it never rains, and I don't typically drive at night because I don't have any reason to, really. So I had the, uh, oh, the dash light uh, switch or whatever apparently turned off because when you turn the windshield wipers on, everything dims, you know? Um, so I had to turn those on, and let's see. It looks like you can turn them all the way, almost all the way off, and then they're is a setting just before it kind of clicks and then they're like on on which is where i want them you know like on on so here we go all right we're gonna get out onto the road we got semis going by let's turn you around so you can see there you guys can see it is indeed raining and enough uh rain to fly up from underneath the semis okay here we go Again, you can see the sky's a little dark off to the one side there and lightening up on the other side, but I don't know. Got the auto headlights on. I'm not sure if they're really even on. All right, we're gonna get up to speed, let you guys hear what it sounds like in here in the rain. That's it. Uh, at 55 miles an hour. So there you go, it's a, it's a steady rain. It's not a pouring driving rain by any means, but we do have uh, rain. Just kind of look.
looking around in here a little. I haven't felt any drips. So that's a good thing. Okay, flip you guys back around here. You can see it's, it is raining. You can hear it, I'm sure. Would have been nice if it would have been one of those downpours, you know, a really driving rain um, to see if indeed the top does have any kind of leaks or anything. Um, I didn't do anything special. I just put it on. So if it's going to leak, it's, it's going to leak as it would if you just normally installed it. I mean, I didn't add any extra weather stripping or anything crazy. I'm going to turn the windshield wipers off so you guys don't have to see those. We'll see how much rain we're actually getting. This is so exciting. I've been waiting for this. I just wish it were a little heavier, you know? But take what you can get. All right, I'm gonna continue driving. I'm not gonna keep you guys on here with me. And then when we get back, um, I'll jump inside here. We'll kind of pan around the edges and stuff and see if there's any evidence of any kind of leaks. Uh, I don't expect there to be, but yeah, I, I guess if I have a leak, given the kind of weather we're driving in right now, uh, then it's probably an indication of a, a pretty severe area that would leak if we had a much stronger rain. So I'll be back on in just a minute. Okay, we're going to start here in the front, just kind of taking a little look around, you know, kind of up here at the seams and stuff, kind of feel it a little bit uh, over here. Not feeling anything there. Looking around the passenger side door, right up here across the top. And you can see if there were water, it would be right along all of these edges. And I'm not seeing anything uh, apparent in here. Don't see anything over there. And really nothing here behind me either. So, not too bad. I'm pretty happy. Must have been a uh, halfway decent install. I did it. Anyway, I just wanted to get out while I could. It's it's exciting because we never get rain here. Um, so I haven't had an opportunity to, to test it really. Um, at least during the day when, you know, I'm not in bed and it's raining. So pretty good. I'm happy with it. No, uh, no leaks that I can tell. Um, the real test, of course, is going to be when I get stuck in one of those massive downpours, um, which is gonna happen sooner or later. But so far, so good, no rain, I'm happy with it, awesome. Leave a comment down below if you've done this top, this Sunrider soft top for the for Jeep or for Gladiator in this case. Um, let me know if you've experienced uh, any leaks or anything in yours and what you might have done to fix it. Also, shameless plug, if you haven't before and you're interested, Check out my other channel. It is Rob Motive, all about my 2020 Toyota Tacoma. And don't forget to click that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Stay safe out there and drive. Bye.